हेलो वन वेलकम टू पार्ट 153 ऑफ लार नंबर 9 सीरीज इन विच वी आर क्रिएटिंग द मल्टी वेंडर ई-कॉमर्स वेबसाइट सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू जनरेट द बारकोड एज वेल एज द क्यूआर कोड फॉर आवर ऑर्डर इनवॉइस इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव सीन दैट वी एबल टू जनरेट द ऑर्डर इनवॉइस एंड यू कैन सी दैट वी हैव द प्रिंट ऑप्शन फॉर एवरी ऑर्डर हियर and you can simply click on any of the print option and we can able to see the order invoice for any of the order okay so if in case of cod it will be already paid okay if uh, it is uh, any other prepaid method that we have not done so far we are going to add uh, paper and other payment methods uh, very soon then it will come as the prepaid in that already paid sign will not be there but we need to add here the Uh, that barcode also uh, you may have seen that the barcode is there uh, like if you are going to search this barcode uh, you can uh, simply uh, search here the barcode so such kind of barcode you can see in front of every product on the wrapper uh, of every product you can see such kind of barcode not only in products but it is also there in order invoices like uh, if you are going to see any of the invoice like if you will uh, uh, shop something from the amazon also you are going to see the order invoice have some kind of barcode okay so this barcode uh, like it says like it, this barcode is a method of representing data in a visual machine readable form so uh, for the security reason this bar barcode is there and the barcode generator that uh, that equipment that uh, uh th there is the barcode uh, barcode machine that able to scan this barcode and all the information about the product will come on your display like you can also scan from your mobile now these uh, these days you can scan this barcode with your mobile also okay uh, but in specific cases this barcode can only be scanned with the barcode machine that are available with the uh with those uh with some specific courier partners okay not with everyone so uh, that person will simply scan this barcode so that the complete information of the order will come its price its details everything will come on the display on the barcode machine itself okay so that that receipt will also come up and other things will also come up okay so we are going to uh, add this barcode in our order invoice you can see uh, here like with every order and with every product also we can add these barcodes okay so let's do uh, one thing we are going to search uh, for some barcode uh, script here uh, we can simply search here uh, something like uh, integrate barcode in laravel integrate barcode uh, bar code in laravel okay we will search it like this and here you will get a few of the website but we are going to uh, open this one uh, we are going to add this package milan barcode okay here you can see uh, this package is here so we are going to add this package we are going to copy this one and we will run for our project uh, st docs this is our project i'm going to right click services new terminate folder i'm going to paste and i'm going to run this one i'm going to install this package uh, that will help us to add the barcode uh, generator script okay uh, so i'm going to install this one it will take few minutes and see it has been done okay so it has been done you can see that the milan barcode has been installed for our project so now uh, we can use this barcode here you can see the barcode specific scripts are there okay though one thing i want to tell you that this is the dummy script for generating the barcode but uh, your courier partner will give you the script uh, like if you are going to add any courier partner for your uh, e-commerce website they are going to provide you the script for generating the barcode for the order number and the product codes okay so but we are going to use this uh, for generating the barcode and here uh we are going to add the barcode for the order id first of all and here for uh, order id we are going to add the barcode uh, like uh, after this one uh, what i can do i can simply add the barcode inside this uh, okay so here i am going to add 
uh, PHP script uh, okay we can add it like this PHP and PHP okay so inside this uh, we are going to add uh, this barcode we are going to create the HTML okay this get barcode HTML here I am going to add this one like this okay okay so here uh let's take one c39 okay barcode uh okay so we are going to see we are going to add this order id in place of this one this is the here order id will come okay so we're going to see uh, that the barcode has come up or not uh, not come uh, we are going to check uh, this one c39 uh, here we're going to replace it with the c39 and now we are going to check it once again still it is not showing uh, so we are going to change this to the php tag sometimes these tags don't work now we are going to add the echo here and the here also we are going to end this one now we are going to see now it must come now you can see the barcode has come up for the order id you can see the barcode has been added here for our order id okay uh, so in the same way we are going to add the barcode for our product code as well okay here we can add uh, for the product code so i'm going to copy this one and we'll add it for the product code where it is here it is uh, so we are going to add it after this one like this and this product code i'm going to copy this one and we'll add it here and i'm going to see the barcode for the product code as well and you can see the barcode has been added for the product code as well okay generally you can uh, see in invoices uh, there is always the barcode like this for the product code the barcode is uh, like this and for the order id like this because see here order id is very small one so that's why the barcode looks like this otherwise this barcode is long enough because the order id is something like one zero zero one two something like this and product code is longer even okay so the barcode uh, will be more longer okay in that cases so uh, sometime we also require to generate the qr code so there is the difference between the barcode and the QR code. Barcode is the one dimensional and QR code is the two dimensional. And QR code is, you we can uh, search the QR code as well. See, QR code here, the QR also means like quick response code. Okay. So uh, here you can see the difference also. Uh, I have read it like, uh, uh, like QR code is the two dimensional. Uh, you can see here we can difference here you can see uh, QR code or omnidirectional meaning that they read from any angle QR code 100 okay so even the QR code are better than the barcode okay uh, but we can use the barcode uh, see whatever the shipping partner will provide us we are going to use that okay uh, so here you can see like I am telling you barcode can be represented in two types one dimensional and two dimensional okay so qr code is one type barcode stores number in the print format i'm going to see uh, okay so here uh, barcode you can see it can be one or two dimensional qr code is a quick response it allows us to encode or store over uh, this much characters okay so uh, we are not required to go that much deep uh, just uh, we must know that how to generate these barcodes okay uh, though the shipping partner will provide us then we are going to use their own script for getting the barcode in our order invoice otherwise you can show it like this also uh, so uh, here uh, we can try here it is given you can see the QR code is also given we can try it once okay uh, so here like if I will update it to QR code so uh, it will show here the QR code it is not showing uh, we are going to see front part uh, QR code get barcode HTML okay so two dimensional here you can see the two dimensional this is see DNS one dimensional 
and DNS two dimensional. Okay, for the QR code. So we are going to use DNS two D, DNS two D in case of QR code. Now we are going to see uh, that it is generating or not. Now you can see it is generating the uh, QR code like this. So QR code is always in the square form and barcode is always in the rectangle form. Okay, you can see the form as well. Even in Paytm, if you are going to see the Indian website Paytm, the barcode is something identical. Okay, you, you, you are going to see the QR code in case of Paytm website uh, that is mostly used in uh, Indian website. Like if you click on sign in, you can see the Paytm is having such kind of QR code. Okay, so many of the website use the QR code for the security reason for login. Uh, okay, uh, or for the orders, but in orders uh, mainly the barcode we use it like this. Okay, uh, but for login purpose and for other purpose uh, we are required uh, this QR code. Okay, so right now we will use the uh, that barcode for our order like this. Okay, so you can try with the other codes as well uh, that is given here, and here you can see the one dimensional barcode and two dimensional barcode as well like i am saying to you okay so you can try with this barcode and qr codes and in the next video uh, we will start generating the pdf format for our order invoice as well then we are going to send this invoice to the user once the user place the order we are going to send this invoice to the user via email okay uh, with the order placement email okay so that thing also we are going to do so few more videos on the order invoice then we will mo move forward with other things uh, so that's all for now have a nice time goodbye